inspired homesteading, figured I would let you in on an awesome little secret of mine. Um, for breakfast, sometimes I will do cream of wheat, which is not necessarily a great choice. Um, typically, we would avoid it. However, I recently decided I was going to try to make my own to improve its health qualities. And so I have this einkorn wheat berries and I just grind it and cook it with my milk and it works amazing. Um, right now I just kind of have been making it in a single serving because that's what I'm eating. So, oops, I mixed the wrong cup. So for a single serving, I just use a quarter cup of wheat berries that I grind on the coarsest setting on my wheat grinder, which is a mock mill, and it's about to get loud. do about six to eight ounces of milk. Pretty sure this mason jar is a six ounce. And I'll pour that right in. Grab a whisk and then I'm just gonna sprinkle it with some salt. No measurement here, just a little dash and I use Redmond's real salt because it has the minerals in it and then all I'm going to do is put this on sort of a medium low and it only takes probably five minutes because it'll take a few minutes for the milk to heat up and then it thickens quickly after that so I'm going to give this a good stir turn it down a little bit. I'm going to go make myself coffee and come back to this and I'll show you what it looks like once. <laughs> four minutes on the stove for it to cook and you can see it is quite thick um, super easy thickens up quick and then I'll just throw some toppings on it this is kind of a larger serving for me but that's a okay and what I like to put on it is just a tiny drizzle of maple. You gotta make sure it's real maple. Some things will say, you know, pure pancake syrup or whatever. Um, it needs to have ingredients of 100% maple and not brown rice syrup or anything. So I put probably about, it's like two teaspoons or so, not quite a tablespoon. And then I made Evelyn had this this morning, but this is like a strawberry sauce per se. Um, but I put a whole ton of gelatin, beef gelatin in it. So it's, it's quite thick. Um, and I just do that for extra protein and amino acids. So why not? Um, so it's just strawberries that were simmered down with um, 
little bit of water and beef gelatin and so no added sugar. And then a tiny bit of cream, not much, teaspoon, tablespoon. Uh, and there you have it. That is my newfound favorite way to be able to indulge in cream of wheat and not feel super guilty about it. Um, if you have questions about einkorn, uh, let me know. Maybe I can do a post just on that, but have a great day.